Hi everyone! Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome to my channel. My name is Feel, your resident Zori. Nice to meet you. If you haven't joined the real fam yet, please do click the subscribe button down below. Today, we will be unboxing Born Pink from Blackpink, the latest album. I am so excited because not only that, because I actually got the pink version of the Born Pink album. And then, I also got my bias, Jenny's Digipack album. So we're gonna unbox two albums today. Which is a first, here on my channel, two albums in one video to unbox. So, I think this is gonna be a quite long video. Yeah, maybe because of the talking and everything, we have a lot of things to catch up regarding Blackpink, right? Because it's been, what, two years since their last comeback? So, yeah, I've been looking forward for this day since their comeback announcements because it's like they have been discharged from their military enlistment with that long of a break for Blackpink so we have a lot to talk about and also I know you guys you blinks are so excited for this one we also have another giveaway contest which is a Born Pink album so please stay tuned towards the end of the program the program <laughs> towards the end of the video to find out if what are the mechanics and of course i'm gonna show you guys what the prize is okay so without further ado let's begin the unboxing <sighs> okay blinks it's here so I haven't really opened the entire package yet because I want it to be like a complete unboxing video. So yeah, because in my previous unboxing videos, if you're like an OG subscriber of mine, if you saw my previous unboxing videos, I start with the album itself, like not with the end of these packaging, alter packaging. So we're gonna take our time in opening these albums. So I'm so ready. And actually... I ordered this from uh, from the same seller that includes the giveaway prize. So you get to see now what the prize is for the giveaway contest. So let's see. Oh wait, I have to acknowledge this first. So, oh this is so cute. So I actually got some freebies up front of the packaging. And I bought this from Pinku Soul from Twitter and I'm so happy because it was a very smooth transaction and she gave me like this wonderful freebies very useful you know I appreciate freebies that are actually useful like this ball pen like this pen and by the way ha just to put it out there no shade at all but freebies are not mandatory in anything like for me ha if I don't get freebies it's okay like, it's not a required thing when you buy something. Because I see, especially in K-pop uh, stores, I know it's like a culture thing, I guess, with the K-pop stands that you get freebie or anything like that. But for me, if you don't give me a freebie, it's fine. Not a problem at all. Like, I'm not even asking for it. But if there is, then thank you so much for the freebie. And I got this freebie, this pen that I'm gonna use for sure. And I think we have more here in front. Oh wow, a bunch of photo cards. Oh, I think these are like the K-Town for you. Photo cards, is that right? Yeah. Such a sweet note there. Can you see? Hi, Real. Thank you so much for buying. Enjoy unboxing. Yes, I'm gonna give you a shout out because I'm so happy with our transaction. <laughs> and I got these. What's this? It's a animal sticky. Oh, a sticky note. This is actually so cute. Yeah, very useful. I, I'm super loving these freebies. Very useful. Yeah, we have the frog and the pig. So nice. Thank you so much, seller. And now we have. What's this? Oh, a bunch of photo card freebies as well. So nice. Okay, let's check this out. So, guys, postahan tayo. I think this video is going to last for like. More than 30 minutes. <laughs> Sa dal -dal to, I'm gonna speak a lot for sure, especially when the topic is Blackpink. I go crazy when the topic is Blackpink, so don't even start with me. Aww, these are very cute! 
Can I see the freebies? From the seller I bought this from. I got Jisoo and Rose. Yeah. So nice. The, these are actually like very high quality photo cards. Like, it looks legit. <laughs> yeah, I love the texture. It's like matte. So nice. I'm gonna keep these. Thank you so much for those. Okay, it's time to really unbox now the album. So let's check. Hopefully, it's not much of a hassle to open the bubble wrap packaging. Ugh. Okay. I'm sorry, guys. When I, I'm not really like a beautiful... Beautiful? <laughs> like, I don't open or unbox in a very beautiful manner. <laughs> because I am very impatient. And I just wanna see what's inside so I just cut wherever I can cut for the sake of opening and seeing what's inside so sorry if this looks so messy but yeah it's here and yeah there's a bunch of posters okay so let's check these first so I got two posters and wow okay this is actually nice so big <laughs> okay here here there we go oh my microphone is blocking it I'll put it here okay stretched so we got here Jenny Jisoo Rose and Lisa looking so elegant and very beautiful as usual right yeah so nice and we have another poster to check out I'm gonna put this behind me because there's no space at all on my table now. And here... Oh! Okay, a landscape version of the poster. Okay. There. Oh, I think it's better. Oh, there! Okay. Whoops! Alright. There we go. All pink. Oh, very contrast, ha? Huh? Black and pink for the two posters. Very nice. Very nice. I love it. Okay, first layer of bubble wrap is now out. Bye. Second layer now. But I gotta be honest, ha. Huh? Like, I love unboxing things that I buy from the internet because it's quite th therapeutic when you unbox what you buy from the internet. Am I right? Right? Like, Shopee unboxing, Lazada unboxing, Zalora unboxing. It's very therapeutic, so I love doing these. It's good for my mental health. Now, I see... Oh, is there a free concert ticket? Joke. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I think these are the K Town for you for the cards. Let's check now. Oh, okay. I'm right. Okay, okay, okay. So, I actually got the chance to pick these uh, free photo cards from the seller. So, I picked one photo card for each member. So, of course, I got my bias. Jenny is here. Jenny Kim. Let me see. There. Can okay, I see? Oh, there, 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 there. There's Jenny Kim looking seductive and we have here miss jisoo kim jisoo as usual the prettiest i mean they're all pretty but of course um jisoo she has a kind of very distinct korean beauty that she really shines right so beautiful and we have Relisa, also so beautiful oh. And also, of course, Rosé. Rosie. So pretty here. Yeah, so I'm gonna display all of these photographs because I actually bought like acrylic stands and acrylic cases. So I get to display some of my favorite photo cards behind me if you can see. Oh, by the way, I just I forgot to tell you guys. I mean, I forgot to mention like we have a new <laughs> angle, like a new background for my unboxing video. I because I thought, you know, I have like an expanding K-pop collection here on this side. So, might as well show you guys how it looks, right? So, I think it looks nice. Like, it looks a lot. <laughs> so, yeah, those are... Th that's where my money is going to. Yeah, so I'm gonna display these photo cards there on my K-pop collection. K-pop altar. Do you have your own K-pop altar? I'm sure you also have. Yeah. So do you have a lot of uh, albums? Are you more of like an album collector or like a photo card collector or like 
any other merch? What merch do you usually collect from any K-pop group that you really follow? And let's open the albums now. Ugh! All right. Okay. So we have two versions here. And one will be for the giveaway. And I think... Okay, I'm gonna show you guys. Sorry. We have here the black version and the pink version. Of course, I'm not gonna open both because one is for the giveaway. So I'll be opening the pink version. <laughs> because I just I just love the pink color here. And I also love this one though. But this it, this one is for the giveaway contest. So if you want to win this album, better wait towards the end of the video to find out the mechanics to win this album. Okay. It is still sealed, okay? It's very compact, okay? So I'm gonna put this on the side. Let's go back to this one later on. Let's focus first on this album, the pink version. So very easy to open the plastic. Thank God. Not much of a hassle. Ta-da! Gosh, it looks so beautiful. And this is the back. Here. So we have there the track list. All of the songs, the eight songs are there. And by the way, this is definitely. Oh, it's a non no skip album. Definitely, it's a no skip album. So let's open. Okay, let's see what's inside. Am I gonna see first the photo cards? I hope I don't get to see the photo cards yet. Okay, because if I see the photo cards, I hope that it's flipped. So we can just put it on the side and then just check it out later. So there's like a suspense, like a thrill if what photo cards that I get. And here, when you open the box, it looks like this. There, there's like the born pink text. And then when you open that, do we have here the photo cards? Not yet, okay. Ooh, what's this? We have here this one. What's this? Oh, 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 the lyrics. Quite unique. It's my first time to see like a lyric book like, looking like a brochure. <laughs> like this. So, we have here the lyrics at the back. Yeah. There, for all of the songs. Yep. Okay, so we have here the lyric book. Oh, I can't. Okay. I almost missed this one. Apparently, there's something inside, so I think the inclusions are inside. So, good thing I don't get to see those yet. So, we're gonna open this small box or what they call this envelope later on. I'm gonna put this on the side first. And now we got the photo book. Okay, let's check out the photo book now. And here's the CD, by the way. So pink, <laughs> so black pink, right? So nice, so shiny, born pink, very simple. They always go for the simple designs. Time to check out the photo book, guys. Oh. Okay, opening the photo book, it's immediately the visual, the main visual. Miss Kim Jisoo, so looking so pretty in pink. Oh my gosh. Wow. Guys. My bias wrecker. She tries so hard to wreck my life. Jeez, who please. So pretty. So while we're browsing, let's talk about the album first. Um, so I listened to the album from first track to the last track, even though I heard Ready for Love even, even before the album was released. And it's definitely a no-skip album. Like, all of the songs, they're good in their own aspect because what I also love about this album is it's very diverse some of the songs it's nothing that we've heard from them before so it's definitely like their most experimental album yet I think my favorite song from this album it's so hard to pick guys okay my favorite song from this album is I think Shut Down Shut Down and Type of Girl. Those two. Those are my favorite songs. And my most shocking, <laughs> the most shocking song for me is Tally. Like, 
when I heard that song, Tali, like, Ooh, okay, they're going for that, huh? They're saying those curse words now, so. Uh, it's just, it was, it was a very fun moment for me, my, like, my first time to listen to Tali. That's a crazy listen. I was like, oh no, Jisoo saying that word. Yeah, so it's really funny. But I love that song, Tali, as well. And Happiest Girl. Happiest Girl, it brings you to a place that you've never been before. It's like you're going through a very tough time. Even though you're in a happy place right now, it's like you're being transported back into a very vulnerable moment in your life. And you're just there listening to the Happiest Girl blasting through the air in your room. So... Happiest girl, my gosh. Sometimes I actually listen to Happiest Girl before going to sleep. Like, it's like my... <laughs> it's kind of depressing to think about it now. Yeah, but... I listen to The Happiest Girl before I go to sleep. Sometimes. It helps me sleep. <laughs> oh my gosh, my bias. Jenny. Jenny Kim. So I guess they're all wearing pink hair because it's the pink version. Okay, makes sense. So the black version, spoiler alert, I think they're all wearing color black there, I think. Yeah. So if you are the winner of the giveaway contest, let me know if what are they wearing in the photo book of the black version. Okay? <sighs> insane, insane visuals. Gosh. You know, I haven't talked about it, this one before yet, I think. But since I'm a Dory, I'm not sure if I had talked about this before. But I actually first listened to Blackpink when I got Just Dance 2019 or 2018. Something like that, yeah. Because my niece and I, we were dancing, we were looking for songs to dance to while we were playing Just Dance 2019. And then my niece knows Blackpink. Before me, before I had like a clue about their music, and then she tried to dance the uh, she tried to dance do 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 in that oh my gosh it's so dangerous sorry <laughs> you look like a killer um, yeah she tried to dance to do 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 and just dance and I was like oh wow this song is what I've been missing because. FYI, before, I don't listen to K-pop really. Like, I just listen to Western pop. And I have to be honest, like, in the recent years, sadly, pop in the West, in the West, is like slowly dying. Yeah. I miss the times where like Lady Gaga, Katy Perry, Taylor Swift, Rihanna, Beyonce, all of those pop goddesses are like battling for the best song of the year. But in the recent years, I don't know. It's kind of less poppy now. Yeah. So when I discovered Blackpink, I was like, oh my gosh. It like opened a world. Like it opened a door to a new world for me to enjoy a different kind of music or the music I've been looking for and I've been craving for for the past years. And I'm so happy to discover Blackpink. To be honest, they're the ones who really... Uh, made me indulge into the world of K-pop. So, since then, I've been listening non-stop to Blackpink every day. I've been watching their live performances and checking out their interviews, learning about each member, and I fell in love with all of the members. And honestly, what I also love about Blackpink is the the bad bitch vibe that they always give to their songs. Because I know they have a lot of haters. I don't know why. People just love hating on Blackpink. They create a lot of reasons, like very small reasons for you to hate on Blackpink. Like, why? Like, why do you have to exert so much effort to hate on a group of people who are just like, you know, making music, living their lives to the fullest, and just being themselves, right? So, crazy, crazy people. But then we have the loyal fans like me. <laughs> Who, who are just really supporting them non-stop as well. And here is Rosé with the very unique hairstyle. It's like a snake. Yeah? It's like a snake going down her face. I just hope though that they get to perform more times because 
especially for this era, this comeback, like they had the very, very, very few live performances. It was very limited, and yeah, I mean they're very good live. Especially, I think my favorite perform- performance of theirs is the Coachella one. Like the Coachella performance, that's crazy. Like their vocals, their energy, like they they are definitely hyped up. So in return, they definitely also hyped up the entire audience in Coachella, which is. I hope I was there. Yeah, but to those people who are there, you guys are very lucky that you get to experience that moment. Here's Lisa, the Lisa Manoban, looking so gorgeous. Ooh, with the blonde streaks there. So I guess it's just like a one photo shoot for each photo book. Yeah, just like from uh, the album, yeah, Blackpink's previous album. It's like just a one kind of photo shoot for one version of one album. Yeah, and that's it. Okay. Not really much to check, to be honest. Like, it's just them with different backdrop and different poses. Yeah, but it's very, it's a very nice quality photo book. That's what we love about K-pop albums, guys. They really exert effort in creating th- this packaged packaged album like there's a lot inside and uh, as someone who collects CD albums before during my western pop era <laughs> it's very different with <laughs> the K-pop albums like there's so much to look forward to yeah definitely especially with the photo book a lot of pictures very worth it and then let's check out the inclusions the moment of truth guys the inclusions what's inside which photo card did I get? To be honest, I don't mind because I already got all of the photo cards of the members here. So I don't really care much if which uh, member will I get. But I mean, of course, if I get Jisoo or Jenny, may buy some bias workers. That's like a woo for me. <laughs> okay, let's check. Okay, did he sit already? Okay, I think I'm gonna flip this first so there's like a surprise and then drop it on a table. I won't look. Because I will let you guys see it first before I check it out. Okay, I'm not looking. <laughs> do I look weird? Looking straight at the camera. Am I creepy? Okay, let's do this. Okay, first of all, we got... What's this? This one, who is this? I didn't see it. <gasps> Rosé! It's a postcard. Ooh, I got Rosé as the postcard. We have... Okay. This is the larger postcard, so that's one. And then we have another one. What's this? Check it out, guys. Who is this? <gasps> Jisoo! Oh my gosh, so pretty. Okay, I'm gonna buy picture frames. Like, I buy picture frames not for my pictures, but for these photo cards, for these postcards. <laughs> oh, Jisoo looks so pretty. Okay. We have here, okay, we have a sticker, the Born Pink sticker. I'm gonna put this here. And then we have three cards here. Okay, two of these look like Polaroids. So I think let's check for the Polaroids. Because the photo card is like the most exciting part, I don't know. The most exciting inclusion. Okay, who is this? Ready, set, and I won't look. Okay, who is this? Did I get Jenny? Rosé! Did she do the same pose? Oh no, okay. I thought she's doing like the same pose. A bit different, I guess. <laughs> With the hands. And the next one is... Who is this? Lisa! Oh my gosh, I... Okay, I only need Jenny now to complete them here. From this album. Lisa! La Lisa Manoba doing this. Okay. Next one. Uh, moment of truth, guys. Who is this for the card? Ready, set, and let's check it out. Who is this? <gasps> Lisa also with a very blonde hair. Wow. That's a very nice photo card. Very close up, right? Oh, okay. I will definitely display this photo card. And she's wearing like a Celine scrunchie. Celine, so expensive. How much is this? I bet this is like a 
50k or 30k pesos worth of scrunchie from Celine. Yeah, but Lisa looks so pretty here. So happy I also got her. So sad Jenny's not here though. But I will definitely get Jenny from the Digipack. From the Jenny Digipack. Because it's Jenny's Digipack. If I don't get Jenny from Jenny's Digipack, then that's freaking insane. Okay, now let's put this on the side. We're done with this one. Okay, we're done with the album. Now let's open Jenny's Digipack. Guys, sorry I'm taking this so long to unbox. Like, it's so hard not to talk that much. So, if you don't like talking, I mean, if you don't like watching an unboxing video where the person is talking while unboxing, then I don't, I don't think this video is for you. Maybe you'll get irritated by me. But, I just can't stand silence, sorry. I have to speak, I have to keep talking, I have to bring up topics as I unbox so it's not boring to watch. But if you want, you can mute <laughs> this video and just watch me unbox without any sound. Okay. So I got this from Shopee. And... It's actually fairly cheap. It's cheaper than the... The black, gray, and pink versions of the Born Pink album. Okay, now it's here. Oh shoot, sorry. <gasps> Keep moving the mic. Okay, here we go. Here is Jenny. Jenny Key. It's kind of thin though. Like, it's not that thick. I was expecting it to be a bit thicker. But I guess it's just this one. Okay, let's open the album. Let's see what's inside. I'm sure there's like a photo card. Okay, the quality though, the quality of this album is like just paper-ish. Uh, yeah. The quality is not that nice though. Like, how do I describe this? Yeah, it looks like paper. Like thick paper. Yeah, the cover. So if it gets wet, then I guess it's gonna get damaged. Yeah, because it's not glossy, it's not matte. It's just paper. But Jenny can look so gorgeous here though. Okay, now let's open. I'm beginning to see the inclusions. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. So we have with the CD. And the CD is also Jenny Kim. That's really interesting to see. Okay. Parang kala mo, I'm gonna play the CD, you know. Do you guys like have a CD player? Because I don't. Okay, here is Jenny Kim looking so sexy. My gosh. The legs, the legs. So I'm just gonna quickly browse the photos. And if I find something like, whoa, I'm gonna show it to you guys. Whoa. What a pose. There we go. You know, Jenny is my bias because I don't know. I'm just really drawn to her. Like, she has the, this charisma. There's something about Jenny that really captures my attention all the time. And as she raps, total bad bitch vibe. Yeah. Very few photos. That's quite disappointing. Like, it's just this, right? Like, it's like less than 20 or less than 15 photos here. Quite few to check out. But we have the inclusions. Let's check out the inclusions. Okay, there's definitely a photo card. I'm gonna flip. <laughs> okay, what is this? Okay, this is the oh, like a mini poster. Nice. That's quite nice. And then here is another lyric book. Yes, lyrics. And one photo card. Let's see. Of course, this is Jenny Kim for sure. Let's see the photo card. Oh, so pretty. So finally, I got another Jenny photo card from the Digipack. Yes. Okay. I'm happy. Very, 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 very happy and satisfied with the with the pulls that I got. Yeah. And we're done with unboxing. We're finally here. We're gonna go now. The giveaway contest. Are you guys ready for the mechanics of this contest? 
very easy if you're like a pro at joining my giveaway contest i'm sure you almost already know the steps for this giveaway contest okay still pretty much the same as before it's kind of heavy to be honest kind of thick and heavy so i'm sure the person who will win this one you're gonna be really happy when you open unbox so here are the mechanics of this giveaway contest number one subscribe to my youtube channel if you're already here then just click the subscribe button down below quite easy right and also like this unboxing video you're done good step number two follow all of my socials tiktok twitter and instagram it's at super duper real yes Quite easy to memorize, right? Step number three on Instagram. Go to my Instagram. Find my pinned post where I'm posting with this album. There's like a giveaway text above me. And then comment under that post your answer to this question. Your Blackpink bias is the global ambassador of what brands? Without me or you telling who your bias is, I'm just gonna comment there the brands wherein they are the global ambassador. So for example, mine is Chanel and Hair Beauty. So who is that? Who is a bias based from that answer? You already know, right? So quite easy. And also plus tag two fellow blinks in that comment. So the more comments that you put on under that post, more chances of winning this album, this Born Pink album. So guys, just keep commenting and who knows you might be the lucky winner from this contest right so i will be randomly picking the winner from the contest from the comment section there so the contest ends on november 5 at 6 p.m and i'll be posting and announcing the winners on november 6 at 6 p.m on my instagram account so just a quick reminder though this contest is only open for blinks residing here in the philippines Okay, so that's it for my unboxing video. If you have any suggestions or what do you want me to unbox in my next unboxing video, let me know in the comment section below. Okay, I always check the comments so you'll definitely get a response from me. Alright, if you're joining my giveaway contest, then good luck to you and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye Blinks! Stream Born Pink the entire album. Okay? Make sure you do that. Bye!